Good evening, my fellow strangers. It's Mrs. Strange once more. On tonight's episode for Stranger Universe, I will go over the new clip for Stranger Things 4 that was released earlier today, and break it down in depth. Before we start, please like, share, and subscribe to see more episodes from Stranger Universe. Please turn on your notifications to attend video premieres and get a chance to interact with Mrs. Strange and other Stranger fans. Help get this episode to 1000 views and likes if you really want to see us release more Stranger Universe episodes like this one. Please don't forget to share this video across all social media platforms to help fans and viewers join our Strange family and find this great Stranger Universe content. And now, let us begin. A new clip for Stranger Things 4 was released earlier today, and even though it was a brief 20-second clip, it showed enough for us to theorize. Right off the bat, Steve mentions that someone was just murdered, which makes me wonder if this scene takes place sometime in the second or third episode based on set leaks and major spoilers that were leaked for months. The gist of the scene is that Dustin and Max are setting up a base of operations to look up the phone numbers of Eddie's friends. The term base of operations is a key point here because it's used to describe a location where a group of people always reunite to discuss plans and courses of action. In Stranger Things, our cast of characters would always meet up at either the buyer's house or in the Wheeler basement to make plans and solve the conflict in every season of the show so far. However, season 4 will definitely make things different since the buyers have moved out of town and after Mike leaves town for spring break, it seems like the Wheeler parents will find out the truth about what's been going on in Hawkins this whole time. Or at the very least be notified about strange things happening around town and are convinced by the Hawkins PD to take care of their children alongside Mrs. Henderson and the Sinclairs. It is possible that Dustin may be thinking long term here and planning out another hideout for a gang, especially since the threat in Stranger Things Season 4 will be the greatest that our characters will face. This scene has the classic Steve and Dustin energy that lots of viewers love, so we are looking forward to seeing a lot more from it. I'm assuming that this scene leads right into the scene of them walking out of the store and into Steve's car to meet up with the gang elsewhere. That's just my guess. We also got a very short clip of Argyle, Jonathan, Will, and Eleven waiting for Mike to arrive on the place as well as a leaked image of Mill even reunited once again. It's interesting to see how Will's expression is different when he sees that Mike is definitely giving all of his attention to Eleven. Byler vs Mill even this summer 2022. We'll be seeing Stranger Things 4 in less than 36 hours, my fellow strangers. Here's hoping that it is the best season yet. Overall, super exciting times. And that is all that we have for today. What do you think about these new clips for Stranger Things 4? Today's special shout out is for Cotton Candy Rats. Comment down below to become our next special Stranger Universe shout out. And don't forget to follow us at It's Stranuverse on Twitter and Instagram to stay updated with us every day. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to Stranger Universe. Please turn on notifications to never miss another Stranger Universe episode again. Help get this video to 1000 views and likes if you really want to see us release more Stranger Universe episodes like this one. Don't forget to share this video across all social media platforms to help fans and viewers join our strange family and find this great Stranger Universe content. This episode was brought to you by Mrs. Strange, and this is Stranger Universe.